number eight, we're helping you get around Metro Detroit. Some former Michigan legislators are calling on current lawmakers to raise the state's gas tax to fix the roads, but many are saying not so fast. Seven Action News reporter Alan Campbell spoke with drivers at a Southfield gas station. Folks I spoke with say they're wondering why ex legislatures would propose a gas tax hike on hardworking people. A hike many people say would hurt their bottom dollar. Kind of hard on people right now already just living. Former Michigan legislatures have an idea to fix the roads. Why would you do this? Just leave the gas prices alone. I mean, there's other aspects where we can get the money from. It involves a gas tax that will increase by 47 cents by 2028. I mean, a lot of complaining. The bipartisan group goes by the name Michigan Consensus Policy Project. They say the proposed tax hike would take in nearly $3 billion annually. That's just an excuse. They, just, they throw, oh, the roads or the schools, we need this or we have to fix this, and then they'll at tax increase all it does give them a raise. We tried reaching out to ex legislatures who are proposing this tax hike but haven't heard back. We also tried talking with Governor Gretchen Whitmer but we're told she won't be talking about it until it's presented in March. It would include an increase of seven cents per gallon the first year then goes up five cents every year after until it reaches 47 cents. That's something they posted did like five, six years ago, and it's supposed to have been done, and every time it get close to getting done, and here come always these new problems with the concrete. Some say the proposed tax increase is a tough pill to swallow, especially with everything going on in today's day and age. No taxing on the gas to fix the roads, no tax, please. I, I just put 10 in here. I wish I could fill up right now, cold as it is, but that's all I got, so no tax, <laughs> nope. According to a report in Statista, Michigan ranks sixth nationally in gas tax for 2018. One thing many people can agree on, yes, the roads need repaired, but not at an overwhelmingly expense to Michiganders. Reporting in Southfield, I'm Alan Campbell, 7 Action News.